guys, a little bit off topic video. Currently right now I'm actually doing the meatloaf um, edit and you know what's actually happened to the whole lighting scenario, as you can tell. But, I got a nice little request from Red Cow Entertainment to do something for them. I have made, now currently, three references to Red Cow Entertainment ever since last year when they became known on Reddit with one of the biggest views. So, uh, with those three references, they're one of the main reasons why I actually started doing these videos. So, um, yeah, these are the three references. One's mostly about mac and cheese and one's just my personal one. Hopefully they love it, hopefully you like it. Now here are my three personal references to Red Cow Entertainment. One. I told Red Cow Entertainment I would make my own version of Cheat Day Mac and Cheese. And Frankie, from the show, said enjoy it. <laughs> Frankie. But it ain't that simple, Frankie. It's just not that simple. But today, I'm going to show you how to do it the right way. How the hell are you going to cheat the right way? By making my own mac and cheese. Why not just use store brand? Did you just say store brand? I am no mac and cheese peasant. Oh, it's just you, Frankie. Wait a second. Frankie is part of Red Cow Entertainment. I'm not John, and these barriers to a vegan. What is that? No! Oh my god! No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Hell no. Hell no. Hell no. Uh -uh. Yep. Three. Oh, yes, you have to. No, let's calm that boy a little yes. bit. Yes! 